Hi, this course is designed for people who want to immigrate to Canada and who want to assess their chances of getting the permanent resident visa. So to immigrate to Canada, we saw earlier that there are different streams, but now I'm focusing specifically on people who do not have a job offer in Canada, nor a Canadian experience. So if you're a worker in your country and you want to immigrate to Canada by your own means, then you need to assess your chances of getting your PR. If you have the four elements that I'm going to mention here, then you can start preparing an application and submitting your file. Let's review those elements for a second. The first element is your eligibility as a skilled worker. It means that you have one year of work experience in category 0A or B, and we're going to see that in a specific video, how to find your occupation code and determine that you are actually a skilled worker per Canadian standards. Element number two is your educational credential assessment. Before you go on and you pay the $300 for the assessment, you can do a preliminary assessment for free. I'm going to show you how to do that using an official tool and determining whether your diploma is worth something in Canada. That's number two. Number three is meeting the proof of funds. So again, there is a specific video about it and we're going to see exactly what it means to meet the proof of funds, how much money you need to have, what are the accepted proofs and how long you need to have that money on your bank account. And then the final element and the most important in my opinion is the optimal score. Now, based on your profile, you get a certain score in the express entry and that is based on your age, your level of education, your language proficiency, etc. That is your actual score, but it's not your optimal score. Optimal score is your actual score maximized based on your situation. So we're going to see in a few case studies how to calculate your actual score and how much you can improve to get to your optimal score. If your optimal score enables you to get invited, then you're in business. Then you can start preparing your application. So throughout this course, we're going to see all these four elements in details. And at the end of the course, you're going to find a link to book a meeting with me. And we're going to review all those elements together. If you have four on four, then you are ready to start seriously preparing your application to Canada. And if not, I'm going to tell you how you can overcome based on your situation and on your objective, the limitations that you have. I hope you will qualify and I'll talk to you very soon. Bye.